How to Remove Reactions from Outlook Email? Have you ever wondered how to turn off those reaction buttons in your Outlook emails? Maybe you find them distracting or just not necessary for your workplace communication. Well, you're in luck because Microsoft has provided a few ways to disable these reactions. First, let's talk about doing this through Outlook on the web. When you're drafting a new email, you can actually disallow reactions right from the start. Here's how. Sign in to Outlook on the web, click on the New Email button, and open it in a new window. Then click on Options and enable the Disallow Reactions feature before sending the email. This way, the recipient won't be able to react to your email with those emojis. For a more comprehensive solution, especially if you're managing an organization, you can use the Exchange Admin Center. Here you can create a mail flow rule that adds a spe specific SMTP header to emails, which tells Outlook to disable reactions. To do this, you need to define a custom header named XMS Reactions with the value disallow. You can achieve this by running a PowerShell script, custom header name XMS Reactions, a custom header value disallow, rule priority, new transport rule as name, disable reactions. Set header name, custom header name, set header value, custom header value, priority, rule priority. This script creates a new transport rule that will apply to all emails, ensuring reactions are disabled across the board. If you're verifying whether reactions are indeed disabled, you can check the email in Outlook. When reactions are disabled, the recipient won't see the reaction button in the email and they won't be able to send reactions back to you. So, whether you're a user looking to avoid distractions or an admin managing company policies, there are clear steps you can take to remove reactions from Outlook emails.